Hey guys, it's Anthony Fontana here. I'm a CPA with EA Tax Resolutions. Well, today I'm gonna to let you in on a little secret. Renters and landlords of California, if you have unpaid bills back from April of 2020 or looking for some help paying rent and or utilities moving forward, so long that you qualify, California will pay it 100%. You heard it right. Rent and utilities paid 100% from California if you qualify. All right, so how do we qualify to get our rent paid by California? Number one is kind of obvious, but you gotta be a California resident. California's paying the bill here. You gotta be a California resident. If you're a resident of any other state, it doesn't work. So California residents only. Number two, and I'd say the most important is you have to meet certain income qualifications. So the income depends A, on which county you're in, and then B, how many household members are in your house. So there's a link to kind of help this out. And if you see here, I'll include a link to this in the description, uh, but you kind of just go through this. Okay, who are we, a landlord or tenant? Uh, let's say we're a tenant. Uh, are we part of one of these tribes? We'll say, let's say if we are, you would say yes. And if you belong to one of these tribes, you're gonna click, okay, whatever tribe it is. And it's gonna give you a, phone number to call, right? Different numbers for different tribes here. So you'd have to go through this to do this, uh, to get your rent paid if you're part of a tribe. But let's say we're not, um, then it depends which county we're in. Let's say we're in LA and we have a household of three, right? It's me, my wife, and my daughter. So there's three of us here. If your income is 85K or less, then you say yes, right? You continue, then basically you qualify is, is how this works, okay? And then there's gonna be a couple other questions, other things to qualify. Uh, have you or anyone, you just read this question, in your household qualified for unemployment benefits, experience a reduction in income or experience other financial hardships due to COVID-19, let's say yes. Do you have past due rent notice and eviction notice and can demonstrate housing instability or risk of homelessness, past due utilities, or do you need assistance paying future rent utilities? Say yes. And if so, there you go, you would qualify. Um, plug here guys, if this is helpful, be sure to subscribe and like this channel. I'm gonna continue here. There's a couple other things we need to go over though, okay? So when you go ahead and click that apply now button, it's going to, uh, ask for certain documents because you will need paperwork to justify that you can qualify here. So depending upon if we are applying as a landlord or as a tenant or a renter, you'll see here what documents you would need to apply with. Uh, so if you don't have this, you'll need to get this done in order to apply for these rent payments. Here's one thing I should note though. Uh, if you do get the rent payments as a renter, this will not be included in your income as taxable income on your tax return. However, as a landlord, if you apply and you do get these payments, this will be counted towards income. So that's just one thing uh, to note there. Again, to apply, you're just gonna check this box here or uh, click that button. And again, I'll include a link to this. You'll hit sign in here. Uh, and you, you know, or you got to create a, an account and then go through all the fun steps of verifying your income, your name, all the info that they're asking for. It's relatively easy to do. Now, if you're looking for some help on this, uh, California does have help. Okay. So as you see here, you can either call this number right here or you can go into some places, right? So if we're in LA County, depending upon where you're at, you're in LA County, it'll give you a list of places that'll actually help you out with doing this application. All right, another thing to note real quick, landlords will need their renters to participate in order to get paid back rent or rent moving forward as California needs to know the income of the renter. Vice versa, the renter though does not need the landlord to participate in order to get paid. Now, if the landlord does participate. The landlord's gonna get paid directly. If they don't, the renter will get paid and then has to pay the landlord. Uh, now, if the landlord initiates this, then yes, the landlord's gonna get paid directly. All right, guys. Well, I hope this video was helpful for you guys. As usual, like, 
share, subscribe, leave a comment if there's something else you'd like me to go over here. Uh, thanks so much for checking it out.